What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Your favorite pit master here, Eddie Wright, and I'm checking in here for you to show you how to do amazing barbecue. But today, we're doing something a little bit different. We got a mail call. Boom. Two items from the UPS delivery truck. Sat down with a group of my barbecue brethren, and uh, we normally chop wood. That's having a conversation with those who don't know. And uh, we talk about new products, new things, great ideas, bad ideas, or what's been through the funnel already. And a very good friend of mine, uh, a gentleman by the name of Steve Lick and Tracy Hobson, chopping wood with those two guys. And uh, we were talking about a few new products that we thought may be great to have because they were great products that had great reviews. So, with the great advice from those great gentlemen, we made purchases. And those purchases finally came in. So with that being said, we're gonna unbox, we're gonna talk about it, and we're gonna let you guys see what we purchased. Here we go. Cover these up. Here today for your viewer pleasure, we have our items. We'll flip these over so you can't see the addresses. And we're gonna open the smokes package first and we're gonna talk about what it is. The paperwork. Here we have some amazing Spitjack Deluxe Fireplace Gloves. These are important to us for this one reason. On our CTORR, it works off of a fire basket when we're in competitions. Usually we use a pair of pliers to move the basket in and out. With these, we'll be able to basically grab anything of uh, mince heat by hand and move it around in whatever way that we may need. It'll be multi-purpose, most definitely for myself and all the guys on the team. And uh, we look forward to most definitely working with this. So we're gonna open it up, try it on, talk about how it feels. Oh. Love the color. All right, let's see how this thing feels. Oh, that feels pretty damn good. I love the great feel on the interior of these gloves. This, no, it doesn't feel like a foreign material. It feels almost kind of like a very soft wool. Very padded, you can see. Can't make full fists, but that's great. That means it's insulated. The heat's not automatically gonna run through the material and burn my hands up on the inside. I love the way these feel. I like how high they come up. I'm a tall guy, and usually when we reach in the cookers, this sometimes gets burned, forearm area. This most definitely kind of helps prevent that. And uh, we like it really like it like the extra pad in the middle with these squares this is gonna be good all right let's get to our next one pretty sure you obviously know it's also from the spitjack company so, ladies and gentlemen we have more paperwork <laughs> we've got the Spitjack Meat Injection System. It's got the actual name of this particular one, but from what the guys tell me, it's, it's pretty much a Cadillac when it comes to meat injectors. So, as you can see, love the case, built well. It has a little bit of weight to it, so I'm pretty sure it'll pass a gravity test. Let's open it up, see what we got. Boom. Comes with a cool little Card with a QR code. Thank you for your purchase. Pit Jack manufactures and sells a complete line of tools for food and fire to enhance any gathering that brings family and friends together. That's awesome. The Spit Jack Magnum Heat Injection Tool. This thing is built to last from what I'm told and just looking at it, I am most definitely in awe. I've been looking for not the perfect meat injector, but one that will most definitely feel comfortable in these hands that I have that are very large and uh, something that's just basically gonna hold up. So in the past year and a half, we've gone through several different types of uh, meat injectors and I really hope this one is gonna be the one that we hold on to for the longest time. We're all gonna retire our last one that we use for a little while so we can get used to this one. I love the cleaning brushes it comes with, that's nice. Oil for the gun, most definitely. More gaskets, uh, rubber gaskets long for the gun, I like that. Get four syringes, these are very nice syringes actually. Very high quality stainless. I love the way it sits in here. Everything has its rightful place. 
Holy shit. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be injecting with that, but hey, it's good to have just in case. <laughs> I love this one. This is gonna be great for turkeys and just, just a lot of different things, man. Uh, let's take a look at the gun. Now, first off, the weight is most definitely great. It feels good. It feels almost like a firearm. That's actually why I'm holding it like this. So kudos to Spitjack. The metal used to make this unit, I'm very much in love with. It's most definitely one where I'm not really worried about dropping it or doing anything because I feel they can take it. Gonna disassemble it a little bit here. Take a look at the innards. Okay, that's a retaining ring, more than likely. Same thing like my other one, my butcher block one. This should come off. I love what this has to offer. I love the way it feels. It is most definitely made to last. You've got your dial here where you can dial it from one all the way up to five. The amount of injection that goes into the protein per trigger pull. I love the way it feels. It feels sturdy, it feels right. I think this is most definitely gonna be one of the more long-term injectors that we're gonna keep in the arsenal. I'm very excited to have it. This is the Spitjack Magnum, guys. We're very happy to have it in the arsenal. We think you should grab it if you do have the chance. Go to their site. They have some specials for the holidays. We're gonna get ready to put this to immediate use on support butts. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure you continue to like, share, subscribe to everything that we have going on with the channel. I look forward to seeing you guys again sometime soon. Continue to roll smoke pit masters. And always remember, you too can do amazing barbecue the right way. We'll see you next time.